students and teachers the threat that hinges upon us, the more safe they're going to be. <coughs> because of prices alone, every teacher will be able to lock down the school. Now, there's two steps. If you're a classroom teacher, there's nothing more alarming than for a student to have a seizure. And if that occurs, you've got to stop, go to the telephone, and make a call to the administration in order for someone to come. With this new system, that, that will no longer have to occur. The teacher can push their button three times, and every administrator will know that that teacher needs assistance. Not only will the teacher be aware, but also law enforcement will be aware as well. In addition to knowing who, we will also instantly be able to know where and which room it's occurring. So that, there's two levels of notification. The first level is what we call tier one. There's a fight, there's a child that's down, that uh, we call it non-emergency. There's a second one where the teachers will press the card for multiple times up to six. And we know that there is an intruder in the building. And so they have the authority without an intruder knowing no, to notify us if there's a bomb threat or if there's a gun on campus or if they just need emergency, need assistance because a child is sick. We are excited <coughs> about some teachers. We are excited about equipping our teachers with the authority to lock down the school. So we're excited. This time, we want to bring the governor up. state and 